Go. Hey guys. So now I can show you my uh, home and studio here in Rome. This is the entrance room. So when you come visit me off a cruise uh, in Rome, uh, you'll come into this room and you'll see this sculpture, which is bronze. This is my brand new sculpture called Eternal Embrace. It was just delivered here. It weighs well over 600 pounds and uh, came in with a crane through the window. So this is the latest entry. Here is a painting from 1995. This is a vintage painting. This actually is not for sale. Uh, this I'm reserving for my next big museum show, which will happen next year in the city of Florence. And this is a picture of Castavi World as it appeared in 1995 with the self-portrait, realistic here on the TV screen. This is the self-portrait. That's the self-portrait. This is a self-portrait as a pianist and composer. These are my employees punching time cards to go into the um, uh, painting room, which could be viewed through this peep show window. The public could put a quarter in, and for 15 seconds that window opened up and you could see me here, another self-portrait, destroying a painting that didn't meet with committee approval. There's my book, Kostavi, The Early Years. And that, that's my painting that was on the cover of Guns N' Roses, Use Your Illusion 1 and 2. So this is called The Rhythm of Inspiration. And then here, in this room, is, this little room is where I make my drawings. Uh, I, uh, I draw here, at this table. Here is a drawing uh, that features Venice. I love all of Italy, especially Rome and Venice. And here's a romantic couple on a gondola with a gondolier. So I draw on this table, and I run Kostabi World from uh, this computer. I pass a lot of time in this little room. Then I pass some time in this room, watching movies. Uh, this is, uh, I guess, the living room. And this is where I sit and watch the movies. Here's my T, my T Amo pillow, T Amo, and the miscellaneous paintings. This one's from 1990. Someone just reserved this one. Might not be here in a few days. I actually got this back in a trade recently. I sold it back in the early 90s and traded two smaller paintings for that because the collector was moving into a bigger studio. So I come in this room and. This is the music room. Uh, it's all red, and most of the paintings are, have red, like my shirt. There's the red chandelier, which I love. Here is my red electric piano right here, my Nord Stage 2. Some mysterious notes. This is the chimes. And in this room here, oh, this, this room here, Tulesia Pavon. This is where I uh, sign paintings and uh, title them and, and uh, show them to you. Here is a brand new painting, so new, it doesn't even have a title yet. The back is Virgin Raw Cotton Duck, Oil on Canvas, it's a ballet dancer. That's brand new. Same story with this one. Maybe if you come over here, the lighting will be good. This is a uh, contem contemplative figure sitting on a red flower. Also, virgin, but by the end of this telecast, it will be titled. Here is a vintage painting I just found. Harmony in Rome from 2015. That's what the bats look like after they're no longer virgin. And it's a self-portrait of me playing the piano in Rome. So that is a small. Going up to medium, here is a brand new painting of mine called <clears throat> Emotional Illumination. Now this went viral. People love this on social media. This is from 2020. Emotional Illumination. And it's a positive uh, interpretation of technology among the, uh, in, a, in a romantic couple situation. Okay, now here's something I'm very excited about that I've been doing. Some of you have seen these. This is a a multiple, a Park West published multiple called Uno Matina. It's called that, that means one morning, and there's 
big TV show here in Italy called Uno Martina. And I went on that show and presented the original of this. This is a gicle on canvas, Swiss Q print on canvas, and then I'm going to do a hand worked um, embellishment on it. I'm going to hand work it with a drawing of an angel, perhaps. Here is uh, my dream. I have never been on a cruise ship, and there's basically one reason I decided to work with Park West Galleries, and that's because, you know, I'm from Southern California, and I'm middle class, and we like free stuff, and the idea of going on a free cruise appeals to me. And so, hasn't happened yet, but I'm sticking with Park West uh, until I get on the, uh, forever, but uh, the main goal is to get on a cruise. So I guess their strategy is don't send him on a cruise yet, because what if he doesn't like it? But I'm sure I'll like it. And there's an angel protecting a cruise ship. Brand new painting, it's called Guiding Light from 2020. And then there's a companion piece to that, which is much bigger. This one is called Guardian Angels. So that's two angels protecting a cruise ship. Let me show that to you again, because there was a canvas thread obstructing it. Guardian Angels. 2020, it's 90 by 120 centimeters. And uh, these are some of my latest paintings with that night, that earlier one sprinkled in. So uh, here's a collaboration I did with Paul Kostabi at a concert, live painting performance. This is my art collection. There's Enzo Kuki, more Enzo Kuki, Julian Schnabel, Sandro Kia, Joseph Boys. Mimo Rotella, Carla Cardi, Alagiel Guetti, Tama Festa up there. And this is my most famous painting right here. The covers I designed for Guns N' Roses, Use Your Illusion 1 and 2. They sold over 36 million copies, so I'm proud of that. And so if you come in this room, you'll see uh, the back side of the new bronze sculpture. And back to the piano room where I will demonstrate a fragment of one of my compositions called Rabbit Skin Glue. <laughs> 